What was that? Oh. All right. Just open it in another window. Oh. Oh, what's this? Oh, is this a character reveal? Ooh, who is it? Is it Simon Belmont? I've been hearing Wait, Luigi! Luigi's Mansion! Luigi's Mansion zombie edition! Oh! Yes! Yes, Luigi! Same, Luigi! Same! Is it Professor Egad for Smash? Is he already in? Oh my gosh. No, I feel like it's not going to be Luigi's Mansion. I feel like it's going to be something totally different. Oh, I just. Who is it? Who is it? Simon! Okay, it is! It's Simon Belmont! I'm good! From Pennsylvania! Oh my gosh! That's crazy! I, I didn't even hear rumors about that. That's funny. I like how they used uh, Luigi, like the Luigi's Mansion vibes to like set that up. I like that. That was cute. <laughs> Multi adaptive compatibility. Okay. Thank you. No, it didn't do anything, unfortunately. The multi adapter compatibility. ナイス。特徴はなんといっても聖なる武器であるヴァンパイアキラーの超リーチ。隙は大きめ、動きは遅めですが、通常技の平均的なリーチはどんなものでしょう the axe, the cross. Holy water. <laughs> That's funny, you just throw holy water on your opponent. <laughs> and they just like, I don't know, get fried. <laughs> oh, his final smash is popular. Oh. ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロー。ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロー。ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロー。ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロー。ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロー。ラキャンスタッフ。ヤロ
アレンジを手掛ける音楽家さんの人気も高く引っ張りだこでした That's kind of pretty cool that they got a character reveal going because、uh, they got a character reveal at the beginning. Because, like, you know there's going to be a character reveal at the end. So, ここでせっかくだからもう2体。Is that like the male version of Lucina? Or. Oh, Dark Samus? Is that the fighter for Samus? Oh, cool! Well, that's neat. Okay, so I'm sorry that the video isn't working, I'm very sorry. I don't know what's going on with that. Alright, so let's go ahead and get the w a l l window capture or display capture. I don't know. Oh, they're slightly different. Okay, so there's fight, there, there is a difference. They're not just one. Oh, so they have a few more to announce. Okay. Cool. But they're gonna have some new, some new,、uh, new ones. So that's pretty neat. So they have、uh, Pokemon Stadium. That's a new one? g u a r d i a n Oh, look at them! Oh, how cute! I love it. Magic Camp. 
magic hand. Um, gamer from what? WarioWare? Is that from WarioWare? Might be. Final Destination. Wait, is that just a new version of Final Destination then? Yeah, that's what it must be. No, Dog City Hall is in the end! Oh my gosh! Yay! I love Mario Odyssey! Oh my gosh, look at the music! Look at the musician! And Pauline, oh okay, I guess that basically means that she's not gonna be a playable character. But I mean, that's okay. Yeah, they have, they have the tower from, the Sheikah Tower, so they might as well have something from Mario Odyssey as well. Oh. A lot of effort in enhancing the stage, the look of the stages and rebalancing them. The stages that originally appeared in the S64 game to prioritize nostalgia intentionally keep it classic. Well, there you go. Uh, the stage is total... Turning it compared to all those previous games. Oh! Oh my gosh! The, oh, the total number of stages is 103? That's like double. Almost double. Oh. But, oh, but they're counting all like the different versions of each other. These can also be transferred. Transfer in the Omega. Oh, oh! Oh, so they didn't count that! So if they do count that... If they do count the stage transformation, it's above 300. That's crazy. That's so many. <laughs> stage hazards. Oh, select this option for this chaotic. Okay. The order of the stages matches the order in which they were introduced in the series, just like the fighters. Oh, that's nice. Regarding stages, we have a little surprise. Oh, a surprise. Ooh. Um. Oh, the stage. Oh, can transform around you. That's interesting. Oh, stage more. So you can use the stage more. Wow. This is so crazy. Wow. Oh, you can you can turn up the the music. You can turn it up or down. All the tracks are organized by series instead. Oh, as long as you're playing on a Zelda stage, you can pick any track like from a particular series of the stage that you're playing on. That's pretty cool. The number of music tracks is 400, no, 800! More than 800 tracks. Oh wow. And if you count the other types of music like fanfares, there are over 900 tracks. What? Oh wow, if you, if you play them all without stopping, it's 20, it'll come up 28 hours of, of music. That's crazy. Oh, that's so crazy. What? Sound test menu. Oh. Okay. Oh, so it's like an album for each series? That's cool! I want that. I mean, like, you know, you have to, you have to get this game if you have you just have to, like, honestly. And you can make your own playlists! That's really cool. That's really interesting. 
I wish I could make the window capture work. In handheld mode. Oh, you can make it. Oh, it's the Nintendo Switch music player. That is so funny. A huge variety of music has been collected for the game, and you can sample some of these tracks on the official website. We're planning to add selections basically every week, so please stay tuned. Oh, cool! Alright, so yeah, well, some of you may okay, uh, like to share some things about the battle. Now, first thing you will select is the rules. You can create your own rule set. You can immediately begin playing with those rules at any time. Okay. Stamina battle. In addition to time battle and stock battle, stamina battle is now treated as one of the standard smash modes. There's a different feeling of intensity in these battles. Ooh. Intensity. Stage selection comes through. Well, doesn't it always come first? This way you can pick a fighter based on how well suited they are for the stage. Oh, 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 yeah, so usually fighter selection comes before. Okay, that works. But I think, you know, everybody has their main, so they're not really probably gonna do that. To be honest. But. Ooh, sudden death. The camera steadily zooms in? Oh, that's crazy. Oh, man. Final smash meter will fill, and once it's maxed out, you can use a weaker final smash? Oh, oh, in this mode. When you apply this option to a match, it seems to be really flashy. If you're up for a party, you can just try that. So that basically makes final smashes more frequent. Oh, but no two final smashes will happen simultaneously. Looks like Montero Sakurai got a haircut. It's like you got a haircut. Squad strike. Squad strike? What? Oh, five or five on th or three on three elimination style. Oh my gosh. It's like Smash Battle Royale. I mean, like, it is. Smash Battle Royale. And then they, of course, are going to have tournaments. Um, Smash Ultimate Cup tournament. Um... Oh my gosh, it's crazy. crazy guys. Hey Booming Team and everyone else, welcome to the stream. Um... We're just reacting right now. And of course I can't get the, the screen to work, so... That's nice. Also strategically pick a fighter you oh your opponent isn't good at a The new training mode will feature an exclusive stage. We've we just played a grid so it's easy to measure your distance. Oh interesting. Oh wait, you also display a launch distance wait, wait, is this the part? Yeah, training, I think. So, nice! The red line prediction drive you zero percent damage and the blue is one hundred percent damage. Okay. Oh, that's cool. And then we have classic mode. Um, is this a single player? Wait. No, it's not. Each fighter has a set series of stages and opponents they face. Okay. Let me introduce you to some items, some new items, Pokemon, and this is trophies. Okay, so for, uh, new items, I think that's what they're doing first. They've got a little, like, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong blows people up with a banana. Looks like a banana fires one powerful, oh my gosh, it's a banana gun, are you serious? Killing edge when it glows. Its power intensified, so it's like a sword. Lift, uh, the bomber lifted up and this powerful bomb will explode. Well, there you go. Death Scythe, um, instantly KOs fighters who are badly damaged. Oh, wow, okay. 
Its power will increase the further you are from the target, the staff. Uh, rumbling evil mushroom. Reverse the opponent's controls. What does that mean? Oh, oh like left is right, right is left. Uh, rage blast, the higher your damage percentage, the stronger it gets. Oh, that, that's the higher your damage percentage is. The stronger it gets. Oh, dang. And now... Okay, so Captain Fal Captain Falcon just threw a Pokemon. He just like took a Pokemon and threw it. A little executor. Executor, however you say it. Um, I don't know how it's pronounced. So that's one of the new Pokemons. Um Oh this oh the 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 sun one. Oh what is it called? Um and Lunala, Lunala and, oh, Solgaria, I think, from Ultra Sun and Ult Ultra Moon. Oh, Mimikyu, I, I recognize that one. Mimikyu. Okay, and then we got some Vulpix. Alolan, Alolan Vulpix, though. I see Alolan. Marshadow. A ditto. Assist trophies. Okay, now the zero is an assist trophy for Mega Man. Um. Knuckles is in a sister of for Sonic. Um, the Ice Climbers assist trophy is Krista. Clap Trap is in a sister trophy for Don Donkey Kong. Captain is in a sister trophy, a trophy for um Villager. Uh, Chef Kawasaki is. Kirby's is this trophy. Uh, yes. Gray Fox is an assist trophy for who? Fox? I don't know. Nikki is an assist trophy for for Shiggy. Wait, what? Shovel Knight is an assist trophy for who? Wait, what? For who? Oh, a lot of people wanted him in Smash. The moon is an assist trophy! The moon from Majora's Mask! Yo! That's a fun one. All of them can be considered special guests, and another extra powerful one has just arrived! Oh man. An extra powerful one. Who could it be, guys? Who could it be? Monster Hunter. Um. Monster Hunter, yo! Rathalos from Monster Hunter. He appears as a boss. A boss? For the, what? For the single player? Does that mean they're single player? Did I miss something? Actually, he's the first character to appear as both! Yo, that's pretty neat. Before we go, oh my gosh, so it's over? I'd like us to take a quick look at the menu. Okay, guys, the menu. Let's watch that menu. Alright, so it's like Smash. Oh, one of the features is grayed out. There's a mysterious mode here, but we can't talk about this yet. Also, there's a dashboard that can be accessed at any time by pressing the ZR button. Options and control descriptions are listed here as well, um, but that's all. But there is a mysterious mode that they can't talk about that's like blurred out. The entire development team is, oh yeah, okay, cool. Good direct. Is there going to be another character reveal or no? Okay, I think this is just a little cinematic, like a little like art cinematic thing. Okay, now we see Donkey Kong yawning, and 
uh, Diddy Kong and Dog Young scratching his butt. Um. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be K rule, isn't it? It's gonna be K rule. I I know it, it is. It's K rule. K rule. K rule and Smash. Wait, what? King DDD. Wait. I wait. I thought he was already in Smash. Oh, but now, now K rule actually. K rule is coming to Smash. <laughs> Guys, yo. Nice. So they revealed this time they revealed Simon Belmont and uh King K Roll. Yo. Yes, so, uh, K. Rule also coming to Smash. <laughs> there you go. I thought that there was gonna be like some kind of like a like a massive troll, like because everyone thought that K rule was coming to smash. Oh, there we got there we got Belmont and then uh Richter Belmont, Chrome, Dark Samus, and K rule. Everyone is here. Except for they actually said that there were gonna be a few more character reveals. So that's gonna be pretty exciting. Um yeah, all right. So, thank you for watching. Um, yeah, it looks like that is going to be it for the direct. So they did, they did, they started and they ended with um, a character reveal. So that's cool. That was interesting. Um, 